Hi guys, what's up? It's me and Marie and today I'm going to be doing a pretty different type of video for my channel but it's something that I really do enjoy and it is decluttering. That might sound really weird to you guys because I never really talk about it on here but I do really love doing it and I've been getting into it a lot more recently since of all the stuff that's going on. Sorry again for all the background noise if y'all have watched my channel before you know. I have siblings and they're really loud and sometimes I can't edit every sound out so if you hear anything that's what that is. Anyways, let's get into the video. For this video, I'm gonna be doing five things, that's 10, I'm dumb, five things that I have been decluttering or that I decluttered recently in the past week and stuff with all the extra free time that I've had. And not necessarily all of these things are decluttered just yet. It's just stuff that I have in mind. Not in mind, it's like I'm in the process of decluttering it because I don't just wanna throw some of the stuff away, I wanna use it up so I'm not being wasteful, if you get me. You got me? So the first thing would have to- I have it like written down, I'm sorry. First thing is spare chargers and just like loose cords. I have so many of those just from like different devices that I've had and all the stuff and I keep all of them and I don't understand why because half of them are broken. Why am I doing this? And I know you guys do that too. It's just a thing that happens. I store all of my loose chargers and everything in this little box. I have to smush it to shut it and everything. So I decided to declutter them. So I pretty much just kept the ones that were working and I tried not to keep duplicates of any and that actually cleared up so much space I can close the little box that I have now which is so good because I was not able to do that before and I was even keeping some of my extra like Polaroid film and stuff in a separate like makeup bag and now all of it fits inside the box with all of the other cords so now I can use the makeup bag for what it's actually meant to be used for I don't know even something else so yeah really happy about that one now for the second thing that I have been decluttering. So this is one of the things that I was talking about that I'm in the process of decluttering and it is all of my shower gels, lotions, mists, all that stuff like that bath and body works type stuff i have so much of it and i decluttered a bunch like months ago that i just had and i was not using these i actually do still use but i've decided that i don't want to keep buying all those if it's for like a gift or something for a holiday yeah that's fine like i'll use it but like me personally i would spend so much money at bath and body works like it was not okay so yeah i really have been enjoying the hemp's lotion and i showed you guys in the clip it is the pineapple and and melon something like that that one is so good i got that a few months ago from ulta and it's literally amazing but i think you can get it from other stores for a little bit cheaper but i had a gift card because it's like 23 dollars. it's expensive but it's worth it it's so good and i also like the hemp's like body wash the crystal and quartz one so good i've actually repurchased that product because i use it so much it's literally amazing i've decided that i want to use up all of my bath and body work stuff and just stick to what i actually love which is is all of my hemp's products they're so good another thing that kind of has to do with the whole like scents and like bath and body works thing is candles i really i was never like obsessed with candles where like i would buy like five at a time but i did enjoy me a good bath and body works candle every now and then especially during the fall time but lately i just got done using my favorite bath and body works candle which is the peppermint one and now i have like a cranberry one that i use i love the peppermint one i probably will purchase that again because it's so good i don't know i just love peppermint peppermint but what i've been using recently since i ran out of my candle is my diffuser i had stopped using it for a really long time because i was just burning the candles i really love my diffuser with the peppermint essential oil it's so good oh my gosh it like pretty much gives the same scent as the candle just a little bit better so i don't know maybe i won't buy the candle anymore so the fourth thing that i have been decluttering is my sleep clothes like my pjs all that stuff i feel like i have something in my teeth because i was just drinking a smoothie let me check okay we're good i'm I'm the type of person that literally lives in like PJs, pajamas, whatever you call them. I love them. I have so many pairs of like sleeping pants, sleeping shirts, t-shirts that I wear to sleep and I have two drawers, one for pants, one for shirts. Like I literally can't close my drawer sometimes because it's so full. So I actually have decluttered my like sleeping attire once before and I just still have so much. So I did it again the other night. I didn't record it or anything. It was just... I wanted to get it done you know some of my drawers like my regular like t-shirts that i wear out occasionally i did do the marie kondo fold for those but for my other two like sleepy time drawers those are just regular folds because i just pick one up and go i really don't care what i like 
where to sleep most of the time so yeah i got rid of so much and i'm really proud everything fits and in my like shirt section i even have a little bitty box i have a pair of leggings and like two shirts that i'll like paint in or like dye hair in so yeah i do have separate things for that and then behind it i have like some keepsake type shirts that i like just don't wear I'm not ready to let go of them okay so the fifth and a final thing is not necessarily like a decluttering but like kind of so i think that whenever you declutter something you should just donate it instead of trying to like sell it i think for the most part all of the selling your clothes unless they're like actually good quality where you spent a lot of money on them or something like that i don't really think it's like necessary to sell them or if you're trying to make it your job because i know a lot of people they thrift and then they like sell them or like they'll thrift flip and like sell what they've done i love that love that but if the clothes are just sitting there and you know if you're the type of person that's just too lazy to take the picture ship it all that extra stuff at the end of the day most of the time it's just easier to donate it or if you have somewhere like a play-doh's closet in your area which i know is in a few different areas like take it and sell it there if you're the type of person that's just gonna let it sit or if you just really want to sell it you know make a little extra money that's not a problem there are places that you can take it like in your area i know people are lazy i'm lazy i was like i'm gonna do that i'm gonna sell my clothes no <laughs> it would just sit there and i never did it i feel like the only way i would is if it was something that i actually thought was really nice i don't know if i'm the only person that thinks like this because i don't think i've heard anyone like say that before but i've just been thinking about it for so long and i'm like i know i know those clothes are gonna sit there for so long and just make your space look cluttered it's just gonna look cluttered so yeah i'm done going on this little tangent about donating clothes and selling them that's just my little take on it if y'all disagree let me know in the comments and we can chat about it okay so yeah that's pretty much all i have for this video it's just kind of like five things that i've been doing to kind of declutter my life a little bit more i think it's working for me if y'all have any other tips let me know if y'all want me to make more videos like this i definitely will because i like i feel like i'm passionate about it a little bit i don't know i just really love minimalism and all this stuff i'm not saying i'm a minimalist because i'm not by any means i don't feel like i'll ever be like a hardcore like minimalist but i do like to take some of the minimalist ways and put them into my life so yeah that is it for this video y'all can follow all my social medias they will be up here and i will see you guys in the next one also i am going to be uploading on my asmr channel i actually filmed a whole video because i ordered some makeup from ulta i know i'm talking about like decluttering and i ordered makeup like i mean i'm not a minimalist i still like things i just like them neat but yeah i'm gonna try to refilm a different video i don't know my mic it was just picking up every single sound the video was not good at all and i did not want to upload it it was just too bad like it wasn't like oh it'll pass like it was bad so yeah we'll be trying to film another asmr video for my asmr channel and yeah i know i kind of left y'all like hanging on that channel for a long time it's been like seven months so sorry about that i just have not been wanting to film asmr i don't know but since we're on this break i figured why not buckle down and do it now that's it, it ended the video okay bye i'll see you guys in the next one